Hi guys, this is Lucas with the Carlo Precision. Uh, I'm going to show you a uh, quick how to connect uh, your S-Series Ferro scanner uh, to your computer via Wi-Fi. So the first prerequisite is you actually have to have uh, the scanner Wi-Fi on. The Wi-Fi setting on a scanner will be under your Manage General Settings and then your WLAN uh, setting. Typically I use uh, uh, the Access Point connection. So if, you, if that's on, you will be able to see the serial number of your scanner under your Wi-Fi um, uh, networks that are available in your vicinity. So I'll just click it. I'll hit connect. If it ask, asks me for the password, the password typically is if you haven't changed it from the factory is 01234567891. We'll hit next. We'll just hit connect or yes over here. Uh, you'll notice that it uh, tries to uh, you know, verify your connection and the connection uh, verification will actually fail because it is trying to connect to the internet and because the scanner isn't connected to the internet, this will actually uh, say connected but uh, no internet access. But that's okay because we are not connecting to the internet. So, uh, next step, if you're going to do either on-site uh, registration or calibration, you will want to fire up uh, your scene software and uh, if you do not have a scanning tab as i do over here it's just probably because of the fact that uh, you installed the program for the first time and you didn't check down below over here there's going to be a uh, there's a use uh, show scan or i guess user interface show scanning category by default is off when you install the program for the first time but just check it to show scanning category um, once this is checked you will see that this new tab will show up you can click it and depending on what you're about to do you can do the on-site compensation or the on-site registration but in my case i'll go uh, very uh, quickly show you how on-site registration connects uh, the software is smart enough to understand that the ip address that you're connecting to um, is the one that's shown on that wlan uh, screen of your actual scanner so you don't have to input it but otherwise if you if this is blank for some reason just type in 192 one six eight forty three and one hit connect if your scanner is within range and your connection which we saw before uh, has been uh, initiated then it should uh, show you that it's actually connected uh, gives you some detail on your actual scanner and now when you are ready to actually start scanning and do your on-site registration you can do it through the user interface like you would through the web interface but uh, with the on-site registration option turned on um, what it will obviously do is it will scan and find your targets your spheres um, enable maybe colorization and do everything on the background of scene running right now so uh, this is it uh, the only other thing that you may want to do is perhaps add a new cluster create a whole new project call it now I can go into my manage screen and actually see that I have my on-site uh, project kind of started. I can give it another name. I usually like the same name as what my project is. Scan number one, for example. And now I'm ready to actually pick my profile. We'll go shorter distance and you can confirm that you're scanning into the right project with the same or with the correct uh, parameters and uh, the right resolution and from this moment on when you hit the actual start button you will see that the scanner will start uh, its regular scanning but at the same time will be dumping and moving everything onto your computer and registering in the background um, hope this was a helpful video if you need any help uh, leave some questions in the comments below the video otherwise i'll see you in the next video